Well, let's take a look at the developments from the world of technology. In Kenya, portable ultrasound devices are revolutionizing maternal health care, especially in areas where there is limited access to health care. The life-saving technology is helping reduce the risk of maternal and infant deaths in Kenya by enabling midwives to detect pregnancy complications early. Pregnant women are provided with information about the position of the baby and placenta, which can help determine whether a normal or caesarean delivery is needed. Moreover, the portable ultrasound device allows medics to detect problems such as breech positions and determine the baby's sex. According to a report by Bloomberg, India is the second biggest supplier of restricted critical technologies to Russia. This year in April and May, Indian exports of restricted items such as microchips, circuits and machine tools surpassed $60 million. The number jumped $95 million in July. As per the report, China exports the highest number of restricted technologies to Russia, followed by India now. The latest report highlights the challenges that US and its allies have encountered in limiting Russia's capacity to wage war in Ukraine. Space Kids India, an aerospace startup, has launched the Shakti Sat project. The aim is to inspire girls to study space and science and work together with other countries on space exploration. Around 12,000 girls from 108 countries, including the UK, Brazil, Kenya, UAE, Australia, France, Greece, Sri Lanka, and Afghanistan, are all set to take part in this program. Participating students will undertake a 120-hour online course and learn about space technology, building payloads and spacecraft systems. The end goal is to launch a satellite as part of the Indian Space Research Organization's Chandrayaan-4 mission in 2026.